Welcome to Neo Film Reviews. Today we're going to look at The Banker. This is a 2020 US movie. This is a thoroughly enjoyable and inspiring story of how a shoe shiner black kid growing up in a racially divided 60s managed to overcome plenty to become one of the first black owners of American banks and prime building locations. It's a rags to riches story in a typical format, except it is more calculated and intelligent in its execution, as the underlying character have both ambition and drive to succeed. Director George Novi, previously directed the Adjustment Bureau, paced the film perfectly with the rarely a dull moment in the fight for equal rights and freedom to the so-called American dream. Anthony Mackie is excellent as the ambitious Bernard Gerard and mastermind behind all the clever investments and money-making adventure. Mackie combines well with Samuel L. Jackson, who plays the richly connected club owner Joe Morris. Jackson shines with sheer presence in all his flamboyant scenes and creating a lively atmosphere and fun. Nicholas Hout plays Matt Steiner, the front white man for the duo to pull all the strings behind the scene. Nia Long produces a strong performance as the ultra-positive yet supportive wife that becomes the cornerstone of Gerard's uh, eventual rise to the top. All in all, The Banker is an excellent example of how the film an excellent and entertaining biopic with plenty of inspiring elements within it. Filled with excellent performances as we see the characters go through such difficulties to achieve what they achieve, capitalism and fighting through racial discrimination in the 60s and 80s have been depicted in countless films and this one worked out like a candle in the wind. See you next time. Bye bye.